I got diagnosed at 18. I'm only 24 now. It's hard because I wanted to get back into football. I've played footy from when I was seven years old to 18, never missed a season. People don't actually understand everything we go through. They think we just go inside and just get chemo and go, but it's so much more goes on. But you can never understand it. Just before my diagnosis, I'd finished my second year of uni. I was just about to turn 21, enjoying being in my early 20s, and I was excited to move out of home and begin that chapter of my life, yeah. In the last year and a half, my cancer's progressed to terminal stage. There's been a lot of highs and lows and also moments when it's felt like it's coming really close to the end. While I'm being faced with something that's kind of insurmountable and difficult to comprehend, having cancer doesn't change me as a person. I'm still a 23-year-old who enjoys doing things that most 23-year-olds enjoy doing. So You Can Stay, we launched the program just over two years ago and since that time there's been over 13,000 nights of accommodation provided to over 200 families. The most alarming outcome I think is the length of stay. Uh, we have families that have stayed for two, three hundred nights. The You Can Stay program was, it was a lifeline for us. Being from the country, it became home away from home. Quest definitely took a leap of faith, which we're incredibly grateful for. In partnering with the foundation, we both aligned from the start that we were going to provide this, this really important service to young cancer patients and their families from the bush. We'd, we'd go to hospital and we'd endure the treatment and Ember would, you know, be like, let's get out of here. And we'd be looking for the door because we were going home and home was the Quest department. Yeah. And the staff were just brilliant generally worried about if we were okay, so naturally caring. We're you know, fortunate enough to be able to assist Sony Foundation, so the family just focus on their loved one getting treatment and looking after them. I feel super proud that I work for a large corporate that is really purpose-led. We work alongside some really amazing, talented business owners who go above and beyond to look after these families. It was our safe place and I could not be any more grateful. When I was there for that long period of time, it was home. It generally was home. <laughs>